With Uber Reserve, you can book your Uber ride in advance, 90 days in advance. Perfect for all you forward thinkers and planning gurus. Reserve your Uber ride up to 90 days in advance. Uber Reserve. See Uber app for details. Welcome to Morning Prayer and Worship. This is Tuesday, October 15th, 2024. We are celebrating the life and the faith of Teresa of Avila, who died in the year 1582. Oh, what a heritage we have as followers of Jesus. One of the most famous poems attributed to Teresa of Avila is Christ has no body but yours, no hands, no feet on earth but yours. Yours are the eyes with which he looks compassion on this world. Yours are the feet with which he walks to do good. Yours are the hands with which he blesses all the world. Yours are the hands, yours are the feet. Yours are the eyes, you are his body. Christ has no body now but yours. No hands, no feet on earth but yours. Yours are the eyes with which he looks compassion on this world. Christ has no body now on earth but yours. Thank you, Lord. If you have a prayer request, benwarmusic.com slash prayer request. It'd be our honor and joy to pray for you and with you. Be still, my soul. The Lord is on thy side. Bear patiently the cross of grief or pain. Leave to thy God to order and provide. In every change, he faithful will remain. Be still, my soul, thy best, thy heavenly friend. Through thorny ways leads to a joyful end. Be still, my soul, thy God doth undertake. To guide the future as he has the past Thy hope, thy confidence, let nothing shake All now mysterious shall be bright at last Be still, my soul, the waves and winds still know His voice who ruled them while He dwelt below Be still, my soul, dearest friends depart And all is dark and in the veil of tears Then shall thy better know his love is hard Who comes to soothe thy sorrow and thy fear Be still, my soul, thy Jesus can repay From his own fullness all he takes away Most merciful God, we confess that we have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not loved you with our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves. 
We are truly sorry and we humbly repent. For the sake of your Son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us and forgive us that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways. To the glory of your name. Amen. Be still, my soul. The hour is hastening on When we shall be Forever with the Lord When disappointment, grief and fear are gone Sorrow for God Love's purest joys restored. Be still, my soul, when change and tears are past. All safe and blessed, we shall meet at last. Thank you, Lord. Quiet our souls today, that we may hear your voice and know your ways even just a little more today, to know you more. In the name of Jesus, amen and amen. We are celebrating the life and the faith of Teresa of Avila, who died in the year 1582. And our psalm on this day is 139. Verses 1 through 9. Lord, you have searched me out and known me. You know my sitting down and my rising up. You discern my thoughts from afar. You trace my journeys and my resting places and are acquainted with all my ways. Indeed, there is not a word on my lips, but you, O Lord, know it all together. You press upon me behind and before and lay your hand upon me. Such knowledge is too wonderful for me. It is so high that I cannot attain to it. Where can I go then from your spirit? Where can I flee from your presence? If I climb up to heaven, you are there. If I make the grave my bed, you are there also. If I take the wings of the morning and dwell in the uttermost parts of the sea, even there your hand will lead me and your right hand hold me fast. You know me, Lord, sometimes so much better than I know myself. You know me, Lord, such knowledge is too wonderful. Oh, it's so wonderful, it's so wonderful. So, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Our gospel reading on this day when we're celebrating the life and the faith of Teresa of Avila. Matthew 5, 13-16 Jesus said, You are the salt of the earth, but if the salt has lost its taste, how can its saltiness be restored? It is no longer good for anything, but is thrown out and trampled underfoot. You are the light of the world. A city built on a hill cannot be hid. No one, after lighting a lamp, puts it under the bushel basket, but on the lampstand, and it gives light to all in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, so that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father in heaven. Help us be full of your light. Help us be full of your light. of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. 
I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate. He was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Our Collect of the Day, the prayer we pray together collectively as we celebrate the life and the faith of Teresa of Avila, who died in the year 1582. O oh God, by your Holy Spirit, you moved Teresa of Avila to manifest to your church the way of perfection. Grant us, we pray, to be nourished by her excellent teaching and enkindle within us a keen and unquenchable longing for true holiness. Through Jesus Christ, the joy of loving hearts, who with you and the Holy Spirit lives and reigns, one God forever and ever. Amen. Be still, my soul, the Lord is on thy side. Bear patiently the cross of grief or pain. Leave to thy God to order and provide. In every change, he faithful will remain. Be still, my soul, thy best, thy heavenly friend. Through thorny ways leads to a joyful end. Let's take a few moments and be before the Lord in a time of free prayer. Pray specifically and by name for those in your life today, your own hearts, burdens, circumstances, governments things that are happening in the world, whatever is weighing you down today, oftentimes it's weighing you down because the Lord has given you a burden for it. Come to him and lay that burden down and see him move. Nothing is impossible for him today or any day.
so many things happening all around the world, from wars in the Middle East and in Europe and Ukraine, to storm damage and just wrecked property and lives and all of the things in the U.S. to all the things that we don't even know about. Lord Jesus, bring your presence to bear. May your church rise up. May we remember Teresa of Avila. Christ has no body on earth but ours, no hands but ours, no feet, no eyes. We are the body of Jesus to do his good works, to shine like a city on a hill and bring that light to dark places. So may peacemakers rise up in the Middle East and Ukraine. And may those who provide needs and rebuild and bring humanitarian aid in the U.S. rise up. May your people be your hands and feet. In the name of Jesus. Now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen and amen. Go in the peace and the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit. Be His hands and feet today. Amen. Thank you for praying with me today. We'll pray together again tomorrow. If this episode has blessed you, would you send a quick text to someone with a link? saying, check this out. Hopefully it will bless them. And bless you for sharing. Bye-bye.